you know what the budget NASA has? Do you know how much they, they get? How much money they get? Tens of billions of dollars a year. Have you seen the movie Gravity? Okay. That's made for about $100 million, give or take. And if you saw the movie Gravity, that was pretty impressive. I saw it on IMAX, big screen, like, wow. I mean, I felt like I was with Sandra Bullock flying around in space, freaking out myself. And this is what they're able to do with $100 million. What are you able to do with tens of billions of dollars a year since the 60s? And why is it that all the astronauts, if not all, most of them, have to be Freemasons? How many of you know secret societies are good at keeping secrets? So you have organizations, people say, well, it's too big a conspiracy. There's no way, too big a conspiracy, too big a... No, no it isn't. There's over, supposedly over 7 billion people on the Earth today, right? Look up how many people have allegedly been to space. It's about 550 out of 7 billion. Most of those from the United States and Russia. How many think those two countries are very trustworthy? They always tell the truth, right? Their government never lies. My government never lies. And most of the astronauts are military trained. I was in the military. We're trained to keep secrets. Right? Yeah, I, I say don't trust me either. And they're Freemasons. Okay, secret, secret, secret all over the place. 500 something people. That's eh, not too hard. The mechanic has no idea what the king knows. Right? There are people working for these agencies that believe what they're doing is what they're doing. They're making parts. They gotta go on something that's gonna get launched up somewhere. That's all they know. There are other people who sit in front of computers that get data coming from somewhere, and they interpret that data. Are they in on the conspiracy? No. They're just doing their job. But I'll tell you, some, people, some of these people are starting to question their job. People say, well we've, well, we've all seen the curve. If you ever look out, if you ever fly in an airplane, you're an idiot. If you ever flown in an airplane, you've seen the curve. Uh, I've flown in airplanes lots of times. And I would have said before doing this research that I saw the curve too.